Hi all. Hello. All right, so we're going to be talking about the obvious kind of elephant in the room here. Yes. So Kira on the right, put, put your right hand up. There you go. Good. Yeah, Kira on the right. And that is what the box used to look like. It's beautiful, isn't it? It is pretty Look awesome. at the artwork. The Tom Whalen artwork. Um, and it's it's fun. I can see why they wanted to change it. Like a, a refresh is always a good idea. Um, but yeah, so let's go look at the elephant because we need to see what the, the problem is here. It's, it's not beat about the bush because you said it off camera. So I'm going to help say it for you. And you, why? 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 <laughs> what the hell is this? <laughs> This is, this is this is a lucky dip and these are sweet packets it's it, it's a lucky box like mm. you open it and you hope you hope your figure's okay which mine is the waste is old on mine but that's the only thing i'll say um because we all know it it's like when you go to macca's ryan agrees <laughs> when, when you go to macca's and you know or any fast food chain and you see a picture of the burger right any fast food chain, I'm not just going to say Macca specifically, but any food chain, right? Because I will actually retract that slightly, because my Macca's, it does look like that. Oh. So I'm really lucky. Wow. I know. It actually looks and like the thing. The one up the road that I go to when I take dog for a walk. Mm. It's, um, it's pretty good. But generally speaking, generalisation, you look at the picture and it doesn't match the product. Nope. And that is sadly pretty much this because when you open it there's things that i wasn't happy about like the backpack piece is so loose the straps um i mean just look just look what you get look look at the box look it's just it's it's crap like how, i mean what is what even is that i've had denser sweet wrappers and how you recycle that? I don't, you can. You can't recycle that. And what was the whole point? I thought the whole point was so you could recycle the whole well, thing. Well, here's something I mentioned off camera, and I'm going to mention it now, just so we can sort of point it out, is get the bottom of the box. Oh, yeah? Yep. Show it to the camera. Plastic-free packaging. Plastic-free packaging. But you see that little recycle symbol there? 21 times this has been recycled which is amazing and kudos so mm, love that hasbro that is a good start however this right, has 21 on it as well this has also been recycled 21 times so the only reason why this can't be recycled again would be potentially because of that plastic that plastic you can pull out and put that in the bin which is bad but in my honest opinion this is a better box hmm. and you can probably find a way to make organic plastic that is transparent i mean yeah. it it might be slightly more expensive and also might not be as clear like it might be a, a more of a frosty glass but i'd rather have that to whatever what is this what is that i don't put them literally next to each other because i want to show like the the actual box density the size of the boxes that's they're, they're completely like so so yeah look if you if you put them next to each other like bottom to bottom or top to top that works and then let go let or not let go <laughs> i knew what i meant um you can see that that it's not as thick it's not as tall so if it uses less cardboard and we don't use plastic why are we being charged more for the figure for a lucky dip where we can't guarantee what we get in the box and it's going to match it and if we're paying, so if we're paying, if we're already paying more mm. for, where well, everything's obviously going up. Yeah, which, prefer, which is is life and, you know, that's called inflation. But I would rather pay more for something like this, where I can actually see what's inside. Yeah. Than something like this, which is, this reminds me of my childhood when you would, you'd get something and sort of like at McDonald's, it's sort of a lucky dip. You it might is. get you might get five of the same thing. Yeah. But oh well. Yeah. Well, the thing is, you can't guarantee that all the accessories are in there. No. And as much as we want to trust, you know, a big, massive, multinational, multi-international company, 
you you can't trust anyone. Quality control has been shocking. Well, it has. I mean, this is what the. I'm going to do a close up now of, of the head if I can. Right. can do you want me to see? hold it? Or? Yeah, yeah, if you can. Oh, I've got it. I've got it. Yeah, I've got it. I've got it. Oh, bit blurry. I mean, it's not. It's not horrendous. It it's. I, oh, yeah, I'll let you hold it because okay. focus is blown up. But yeah, like it's not it's not horrendous. It does look a little bit like the actress, you know. It it's not like the you know the um metallic uh, White Ranger. Oh yeah, yeah. To me, it looked like Alanis Morissette. <laughs> <I'm> just, mm. <laughs> you know, isn't it ironic? Um, <laughs> don't you think? Uh, but yeah, and this doesn't look too bad. I mean, it's not like you look at her and you go, oh my God, that's Celine Dion. You know, it's... <laughs> it's decent. It it actually looks, yeah. as opposed to some of the other ones. Oh, don't even talk about no. Rocky. That was like Zero Ranger 3. That was just... Who mm. are you? Who are you? You get away from my cousin. <laughs> get out of her car. <laughs> Who are you? No, it, it wasn't... It was more the fact that you just don't recognise it. It doesn't look like anyone nah. that you would know. And he did look dodgy. I, like, <laughs> you would cross the street to avoid that if that was Rocky. Like, what the heck? Exactly. You know? Just pointing out, some people look dodgy. I'm not, you know, <laughs> saying anything. I'm just saying that, you know, he that figure looks angry. That's what I meant. Yeah. Just to clarify. He looks like an angry guy who... <laughs> You know, is out there to cause trouble and, and steal your cousin's car. Um, but yeah, this this is an interesting one. Definitely an interesting one. Mm. Um, but yeah, I think this is this quite literally is trash. Yeah, I just I'm really really not happy. I'm I'm not sold on it, to be honest, at all. It it feels re it feels cheap. And it's not meant to be. This is meant to be what sort of for us a collectible sort of something you well, put on display. He was, and... so, he was something that um, you know, uh, Toku Topics brought up because we love Toku Topics. We do. Who doesn't, right? Um, so shout out to, to Toku Topics. Mm. Um, but this you can display. You can leave it in there. Actually, it wasn't Toku Topics that said it. It was. It was Ryan from Power Rangers, Graham. I'm oh. so sorry. Well, shout out to both of you because you're both yeah. awesome. But yeah, it was him that mentioned it. Mm. Um, that yeah, you can you want to display this? This is displayable. You can leave the figure in there. You can you know obviously with the correct bits that yeah. you know uh, and display it. Where this, you you just want to put it in the bin. <laughs> Because it's not even like the old collectibles. You know the collectibles, you know, the 70s, 80s, whatever. Yeah. Star Wars, for example. And you don't, you don't open the box. And you just had it there. And you put it, you have it on the wall or wherever you want. Yeah, yeah. And it stays there for decades. Yeah, and the, with you. the mint in box. You know, the, where's the mint in box with us? How do you even know it's in there? How can you, how can you, how can you, we can leave it open. Like, I could, re I could reseal this. So how, how would you know? And no one would know any. Yeah, oh, it's, it's mint in box, people. Like, it, this this yeah, is right. worth a million dollars. This is a million dollars. You don't know what's in it. It's a lucky dip. Yeah, yeah, may, maybe, may or may not have all the correct parts. <laughs> <laughs> Open it at your own peril. Um, yeah, yeah, it's pretty, it's pretty crazy. Mm, it's just, and it, it can't, I mean, the other thing is, it can't be a place it's manufactured because these are both made in Vietnam. So yes. there's no excuse in terms of, oh, we sold it to this country to make it now and they're doing a poorer job than this one. That's yeah, not yeah. the case because, I mean, obviously it might be different manu uh, uh, factories, mm. but they're both made in Vietnam. There should be no excuse. To, to why? Yeah. Uh, it's... Where's the, why is there, um, I can't think of the word, discrepancies or whatever. Yeah, I mean, there's, there's a complete disconnect. Mm. You know, and initially people go, oh, it's because they moved factories you know, from China to Vietnam. That's why the quality's gone down. Um, it was bad back then. Yeah. There were issues with the, the figures. There are, low, there are just issues in general. I mean, um, if you check out our Dragon Sword video, you will know that, that there are things that we are not happy about, but we'll, we'll get into that in the next one. Hmm. 
anyway thanks for watching thanks hopefully for watching. you enjoyed and don't let strange people take your car <laughs> or your cousin's car <laughs> <laughs> laters catch you later bye bye